Hello everyone and welcome to Office Hours where we work through problems posted by the community. I'm Stephen Yao, otherwise known as Yao on the forums and today we're looking at uh, an issue posted by um, Nazjarta, I hope I pronounced that correctly, uh, for state graph animation speeds and linking bones during animation. So the issue with uh, linking bones during animation has been solved uh, by attaching um, entities to the graph. But in this particular case, I'm looking at the animation speed or animation issue where apparently there's a delay at the end of this reload animation. So reloading and there's this sort of weird jump or delay. Um, and it's just going to have a little investigation and see if we can make that look a little bit better. Um, just looking through the problem is I was looking through the animation, animation plays too fast for the duration of the trans for the duration of the transition. But playing around with speed and duration value state cause was delayed and to happen no matter what. Okay. So first it's going to be more like identifying what the actual cause is. Uh, sorry, not cause, uh, identifying what the which bit are they talking about. Um uh, and we're going to do this site several ways. So it could be an issue with the state graph, could be an issue with the numbers, could be an issue with the animation. So uh Let's take a quick look at this. Um, I've already, already forked the project here. So let's take a quick look at that. Okay, let's go in and let's play this. So let's push R to reload. I mean, that looks okay. Not entirely sure what their particular issue is, but let's take a look. Um, for this, we're going to take a look at the animation itself. So let's look at the animation, and I assume it's this one, scene.glb, where, okay, so we've got the arms, okay, all right, let's quickly tie the model, because I can't see anything at the moment, uh, blah, blah. actually, not. let's delete that, let's do that for the moment, and... Um, Take a closer look at the the arm itself. Uh, the icon's a bit big. Let's remove the icons. Uh, the icon size. Let's put that one. There we go. All right, now I can see stuff. Okay, so we have got uh, a weapon. Does it have any animation? Render, render, render. Gun, 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 gun. What has the animation then? So we've got animation on the arms. No animation on the mag. No animation on the gun. Okay, so it looks like it's just the arms that's causing the issue. All right. Okay, so is this attached? It's not actually attached to anything, so I mean, I'm a bit surprised by this. How's this working? Is there any script that is attaching it to the weapon? Let's take a look. Uh, ah, so, okay, so there's some reparenting. Uh, so, find the gun. Okay, um, so since. They've already been added, that's fine, don't need to worry about that. In that case, we're just worrying about the animation on the arms by the looks of things. So let's go back to this. Hmm? Uh, preview asset, we want it to be on the arms template. Uh, where's the arms template? So that, okay. So let's go back to this. Why are you not showing? There we go. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Uh, how long does it run for? It runs up to 2.57 seconds for the entire animation. In which case, let's head over to the uh, state graph. Where's the state graph? Okay, so we've got this. Uh, idle. There's a transition. Right, okay. So they've got the uh, is duration normalized. All right, in seconds. Okay. So what's going on here is that they made the blend, the transition where it's blending between idle and reload, 
uh, 2.6 seconds long. So now blending between the two animations during the transition. What we really want here is a short transition, it to be in the state of reload until the animation is finished and then and sorry, and then transition back to idle. So let's sort that out. Uh, that bit is really short. Let's say 0 0.2 seconds. And next time, okay. So here we go. Now on idle, that will play. That will do its animation thing. Uh, link tags. It's odd that there's no animation. I need to talk to another engineer about that. But for the moment, and then on the transition back, this won't be. Is this extra time? Is it normalized? Okay. And what we're going to do is say that the transition back is only going to be active when we set the exit time. Sorry, on the frame that the exit time is set for. So since we don't want to go back to idle until the reload animation is done, uh, we're going to set this to let's say one for the, uh, for the moment. So this, so this transition won't be active or won't uh, won't be activated. Won't be active until the reload animation frame has reached the end of the animation. So let's try that. Let's reload that. That looks okay, I think. It's still a bit weird that it hitches back. Okay, um, let's make that slightly less. Not point maybe nine five. And so that it doesn't, it doesn't wait until it's completely finished. It's nearly finished and then transitions back to idle. Uh, have we done anything with speed? So speed should still be one. Speed should be one. Okay, let's get, let's try again. One, two and a half. There we go. One millipede, two millipede and do. Okay, let's see if that's okay. Uh, so we're gonna send this back to the, uh, the uh the original poster let's see it doesn't look better than this let's compare wow that looks really slow let's try again one millipede two millipede three millipede does that look different okay so to recap i think that looks better uh, let's give that back to the original poster and see what they say uh, so to recap, the issue was that they set the transition, the the, and the transition is where it blends the two uh, animation states uh, together. Uh, so transition uh, transition from idle to reload. So it's effectively lurping towards uh, the next animation, and that was uh, that was set for, to be two point six seconds long, and so it's just doing this very slow lerp towards the reload thing, and it, that would make it look a bit weird speed wise. And also means that the weightings of the bones was wrong as well. Um, we've done nothing to this, uh, to the uh, reload state, and we changed the transition going back to idle to be have an exit time of 0.95, meaning that the transition is only going to be active 0.5 uh, 0.95 times through the animation of the reload, uh, and that uh, duration will also la uh, only last for like 0.1 second. So what should happen is it will very quickly transition to or lurk towards the reload animation. It does the reload animation full, and then it will transition back to idle. Cool. Let's press this back and see what I say. Thank you very much. Take care, everyone.